guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to be updating you guys on pretty much everything it's been a while since i've been here i was sharing a lot of you a lot with you guys about my breastfeeding journey and postpartum and all of that stuff when i first gave birth and i know i kind of disappeared kind of like i always do from here but um I don't know i feel like i wanted to come back because i just wanted to like be more interactive with you guys and i feel like the community that we have on here is so beautiful and i kind of just really miss that i've been posting a lot on tiktok and on instagram if you guys don't follow me on there then follow me there but um that's mainly where i post most of my content nowadays and especially makeup content and tips and tricks and stuff like that and i do plan on getting back on that on this channel because i feel like it's been so long since i've done a proper like makeup video on here but without further ado let's get into it what's up guys so it's been so long like i don't even know how to talk to you guys anymore <laughs> it's been so long like what just happened i wanted to come on here to kind of update you guys on a few things i feel like i haven't done a youtube video or a long form video in so long i've been really like focused on tiktok and instagram please don't mind this i was literally just filming content for tiktok and instagram and i finished filming like about 10 videos but i've been really active on there because to be really honest with you guys i kind of lost like the passion for youtube and long-term videos and i don't know i just kind of wasn't feeling it anymore and i feel like i needed to be honest on that part because i just feel like i'm the type of person that i'm not gonna do something if i'm not feeling it anymore i kind of just miss the community and i kind of miss like just you guys kind of knowing things about me and me sharing with you guys the things that I want you to know about me and my life and my kids and all of that stuff. Um, Grace is literally about to be one next month on the 25th, which is insane. When I was coming on here before, she was literally like a newborn baby and I was figuring out the whole breastfeeding thing and breastfeeding and pumping throughout the middle of the night and all of that stuff. I stopped breastfeeding her in, I think it was in April, May around there. So eight months in to my journey, um, I decided to stop because it was just taking like such a mental toll on me and it was going really good. I was producing a lot more, but then out of the nowhere, it just went back to like the basic basics, like two ounces, three ounces, one ounce like at a time and mind you I was pumping for like super long hours like I would pump for almost a whole hour straight just to get like that extra so at that point it was just coming it was just becoming too much on my mental and especially everything that I kind of went through after postpartum with baby number two the whole like getting mastitis twice in a row and that kind of like took me out completely and you know I kind of like bounced back and I was filming and I feel like after our vacation in December I kind of stopped and I decided that I was going to just kind of take a break and a step back from like the whole social media thing um, and just until recently like maybe like three four months ago I started posting constantly again on Instagram and TikTok and it I felt like it was only fair to come back here on YouTube as well but that's the update on that Isla is good in case you guys are wondering she's about to be four in November which is also insane like I can't even believe that guys like you guys literally saw everything when it came to her as well you guys have been through everything with me when it comes to like my journey as a mom you guys have been through absolutely everything with me when it comes to like my journey as a mom and my mid-20s and like getting engaged after and just like my whole party stage and the stage where i was like going to events and like just like so much i feel like you guys have been with me through so much especially if you've been following me since like day one um and I don't know, I kind of felt like I just owed you guys to like come on here and just like update you guys on like what's been going on in my life and stuff like that. But obviously nothing but great things. I'm really grateful to God, first of all, and just everyone around me who is so supportive and just 
amazing in, in every single way to me as a person. I also started a health journey. I started to take my health very seriously and um, just decided to like sign up with a coach, a nutritionist coach who is helping me pretty much with like my weight loss journey. I'm really happy. I started going to the gym just recently. I also started driving, bitch. Like, can you believe that? Me driving. Like, so much has happened and I feel like I need to catch you guys up into so much. But I started driving. I drive every single night to the gym. I drive myself there and I drive myself back, which is really big for me because driving gives me so much anxiety. And I did. I never did it alone because of that. I always had somebody with me because of it. I went to take my driving test when I was nine months pregnant. I literally gave birth to Grace like a week or two after that test. And I failed it miserably. <laughs> like when I tell you I was sweating, girl, I was sweating. Like this whole area right here was sweat. And my belly was this big. And I'm like, oh, he's definitely going to pass me because I am so pregnant. And I came here. And I came here determined to pass this test. But I got so nervous. Like, I don't even think you guys understand. Like, the anxiety. Oh, my God. Just thinking about it makes me want to, like, crawl into, like, a hole. Like, it was so bad, you guys. But I am more confident now. And I feel like I can go and do that. So, hopefully, I can bring you guys along with me when that happens. Um, hopefully, very, very soon. I feel like I'm a little all over the place. But I just feel like I haven't spoken to you guys in so long. I haven't spoken to you guys in, like, so long. And it just feels so nice to talk. Like, it's so hard on TikTok and Instagram. Because, like, if you talk, you have to, like, minimize it to, like, a minute. And you have to talk super duper fast. So, excuse me if I'm talking super fast. That's not my normal. And I know you guys know that. But, like, I'm just so used to now, like, filming videos for like tiktok and instagram to the point where like now i'm like talking so fast because i feel like i have to and i need to like speed things up because all i have is like a minute you know and on tiktok i have a little more but i try to always keep it under a minute but either way i went off track completely again and that's just what i do like you can ask my friends I start talking about one thing and then I start sidetracking to another thing. But mom life has been mommying. Like, it's been a lot, you guys. And especially with trying to, like, have a career and do this full time and also, like, take care of your health and eat right and go to the gym and all of that stuff. Like, it's honestly been so much on my plate and i just feel like i just need to talk <laughs> like i just feel like i need to talk i need to let it out and i need to talk to people and who better than you guys because like i said before you guys have been with me through absolutely everything and every single journey and every single stage of my life i feel like i've documented absolutely everything and you know i feel like we're a family on here and i really miss that i miss that connection i miss like just you guys like I don't know i just miss you guys and i'm planning on coming back i'm planning on being here for good Ayla is literally starting school next week she is going to start on wednesday and grace is turning one and i'm gonna cry <laughs> and i'm literally gonna cry again like what the hell <laughs> i don't know what's wrong with me today i am very emotional but oh, it's just insane like i can't believe that she's gonna be one and the isla's literally gonna be four and she's going into school like that sh it's just mind-blowing to me i feel like i just had them i feel like i just brought them home i feel like i just went through postpartum and i don't know like it's so crazy how fast time is like just flying by and lately after becoming a mom i'm even more emotional i don't feel like you guys have ever seen this side of me where i'm over here crying on camera <laughs> but bitch <laughs> I've gotten so emotional after I've gotten older. I turned 29 years old, July 18, by the way. My birthday passed not too long ago. And I don't know, ever since I've just been so emotional. And literally on my birthday, I was crying all day. All day. I don't know what was happening, but I just felt like I was letting go of like this age and like entering a new one where like, I don't know, it was kind of like a rebirth type of feeling. It was so weird, and I was literally crying all freaking day, but 
we're here. I'm sorry. <laughs> you guys are going to see a lot of this. I hope not too much, but that's me now. I cry a lot. I've always cried a lot, but like I just get so emotional just thinking about things when it comes to my kids because I don't know. They were like in here and now they're like out in the world just like living and being their best selves. So, yeah. Either way, I really hope you guys can continue to stick around and continue to follow along my journey. I hope you guys have a great night or day or afternoon wherever you're watching me from and I hope to see you guys again in another video. If you like this video, as always, give it a thumbs up, comment down below, let me know what's up with your life and just, you know, update me of what's up with you guys and whatever else you want to know or whatever videos you want me to post or see um i posted like a mini vlog on tiktok of like little pieces in my house that i love i'll link it down below but if you guys want me to do one for youtube then let me know because i feel like i've never shown you guys anything in the house like that except for like what you see when i record so um that'll be fun but yeah like this video comment down below leave me a lot of love and turn the bell notification on so you're notified every time that i upload now so yeah i love you guys and thank you so much for sticking with me and staying here and staying subscribed and just waiting for me to come back and being so patient but yeah